Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to teach you how you can easily use Automisery for your Shopify store. So let's start. The first thing what I'm going to do, I'll just simply click add application. And right then when I have it, I'll just install it. And I'll just wait for a while until it's going to get uh, into my Shopify store. And now we just fill everything. Organization name, short name, website, monthly orders, land in 1000, continue. And here we go. So first, 20 plus free tools to help you boost sales designed to fast growing retailers. And now click start free. And here we go. So we got automatically connected to my store. You can enable sales pop-ups, send marketing emails, or explore other sales tools. So the first thing what I can do is to simply click enable pop-ups and I'm straight away under home in pop-up campaigns. You have options, I will just close this one. So let's say I'm going to choose card recovery pop-up or sign up for updates. It's a default pop-up, I will click on it. Right when you do it, uh, you're gonna have like pop-up settings. You can change the pop-up name here. Uh, you can have coupon here, then active period, fixed or ongoing, trigger, show on timer immediately or after 30 seconds. My recommendation would be after 30 seconds. So display frequency, again, every time anyone visits, once per day per visitor, once per week, countdown, you can have enabled or disabled pretty straightforward then you have a text here that you can change the header and also you can change uh, like the description here also what you can do is to change the form so first name last name date of birth email address phone number and primary action secondary action success step when someone is going to success what they will see and then go to top right and just click save when you got it you can also change the style here and change the colors here and everything if you want to. So this is pretty straightforward how you can actually use the automatically sales pop-up. Click publish. Oh, so wait a second. I will just no coupon. Publish, publish. And here you go. So your pop-up campaign and this is how you create pop-up. Then you have like conversion tools. Uh, that you can enable like bar for free shipping and you can add it to your website you can make the bar clickable change the styles here settings social proof also standard bar below menu then you have social proof here you can enable that too so you see on the right side show recent sales on your Shopify store to increase custom buying confidence on your store. Uh, this was about 25 minutes ago. Uh, this is like really effective thing what you can do. Sales boost, countdown timer, inactive tabs. So these are like, we miss you, which is going to spam. Abundant card tab. 99 items waiting for you and these are like really good conversion tools and it's like really pretty straightforward how we can enable it so i'm just clicking on a free shipping bar i edit the text here initial message progress message goal message then i have style here i have the settings that i can edit and i just click publish and i'm good to go right then i have emails here Emails here are creating newsletter is really straightforward and easy. I click here, create a newsletter. And let's say I'm going to with like the default one. You can choose between these templates. Let's press create. Campaign name is going to be main newsletter. You have an email subject line. This is like what you see here. Don't miss out. Send from email. This is mine email. Send the name. It's me. Reply to. Email, same and the sender mail. Okay. Send to, to your subscribers. 
then you have a content here and you can edit it this is really similar how you edit your shopify website you can simply click here add blocks and you can add a product list let's say button so i just added a different button here i can add coupon and i have like new coupon here then what you can do is to simply delete the sections pretty straightforward pretty easy and just go to top right and schedule or save and you can change simply styles here font colors text header everything and just click save you can also send a test email and voila this is how you can simply create a newsletter then you have like welcome mails uh, this is like sign up via pop-ups abundant cards these are the templates that you can simply use so abundant card 20 minutes you can have it then you have data report coupons this is where you create a coupon for uh, increasing your sales so coupon title for summer collection and then uh, you would just use the coupon then you get conflict discount rules and now i'm going to summer 11 fixed amount percentage of free shipping so i can go then we have a free shipping exclude shipping rates you can really edit it as much as you want active period or you can go expire after a certain number of days hours and it's going to start at this and it's going to go forever click save and voila here we got a coupon and then we have a contacts here uh, in a contact you can simply create a pop-up and it will go straight to the beginning and thanks to the pop-up i will get the emails and this is pretty much how automatically works in shopify so if you're gonna have any questions guys ask me down below in the comments i'm really happy to help you and provide you some guidance what you can do and what you can actually achieve you know so yeah automatically is a really good tool and really easy to use too and that's pretty much it. So thank you very much. Have a great day and goodbye. See you.